victim. Well, Governor Edwards has a better sense of damage in the hardest hit areas of the state, including St. Mary Parish, where he visited today. Katie Easter continues our team coverage from Franklin. I uh, hope they can help us with anything they can. Teresa Trostclair lives in St. Mary Parish, one of the three hardest hit areas from Barry. I mean, the whole bedroom ceiling, some of the walls because they drip down the walls. Got to be changed. The floors got to be changed. The floors are already starting to buckle up. On Monday, Governor Edwards addressed the situation in Franklin, declaring recovery is the focus now, including assessments for federal assistance. But you're going to see, you're going to have people on the ground here uh, very quickly, if not today, but very, very quickly to do those public damage, uh, I'm sorry, the preliminary damage assessments. I wish they would be out here today. <laughs> you know, I don't know if they know how serious it was down here. No one expected this much water. Edwards says they are in the process of damage assessments. But as the governor said on the public assistance side and the individual assistance side, there's some thresholds that we have to meet to satisfy those federal uh, requirements to get there to get the federal assistance. So that's what we got to figure out first. While FEMA has not yet started assessments, the American Red Cross started early Monday. In Franklin, Katie Easter, KTC, TV3.